Bao Mums and Yosef. And we got a glass of bread. Kitty got a glass of bread. Yeah, I got a glass of bread. I'm going to go to a club called La Favela. I think. Oh, yeah, we got, oh, we got three of them. Right, lads. The food has arrived. Look how busting this looks. Poor Bao Mums. Yosef. Rond and Pura. Also got free popcorn. So the restaurant's kind of like turning into a full blown party. And we're ready to move on to the club. Hello guys, so I'm now in a place on Bali called Seminyak and we're staying in this really cool hostel which is literally like almost like a pod hotel and it's like literally just like a little room and it's like the first time I've literally slept in a room on my own for the last like two months because obviously I've been in hostels and look there's even like a little place where I can put my clothes. Basically I'm trying to speak kind of quietly because like all the rooms are like connected so you can hear when people are speaking I don't really want people to hear me vlogging. Today me and Kitty are going to go get some breakfast. Even though it's 2.17, we went out last night and it was actually really shit. There was like no good clubs. It was all just weird men like trying to make moves and I was just like, not for me, but we're going to go to a beach bar today. Potentially Mississippi or Potato Head. Right lads, we've made it to Potato Head. And it's kind of vibey. This is the entrance, and you have to be like searched yeah, yeah, as you go in. Airport security. Yeah, but we love safety. We love it, really. You know, I don't really know what to expect. I'm pretty I tired, think but I'm excited, and hopefully this is going to lift up my spirits. Yeah, we're going to get some food and maybe a cheeky bev, cheeky bev uh, and then see how we feel. And then if it's if we're bored of this place, which we probably won't be, we'll then go to Mississippi. Yeah, there's a lot Although of that options. Place is really expensive. baby, you can get it if you want it. The guy just said we're going to a table without a minimum spent, which is kind of concerning me a little bit. Well, as our food has arrived, being very excited about to dive in. Um, the scenes are pretty good. It's kind of like chill vibes. I feel like the thing we've found with Bali so far that everything's like so like westernized, yeah. and there's not much culture where we've been because yeah. we've only been in a hotel resort and in Seminyak, and like all of the cafes are like bougie, like expensive, like. I don't know. It's not very backpacker-friendly. Yeah, I wouldn't say it's the most budget-friendly place. But, I don't know. Like, we haven't really met any people since being in Bali, which we've only properly been in Bali for, like, one night. Yeah. So it is fair enough. But if you're in Bali and want to hang out with some kind of weird people, <laughs> hit us up. <laughs> Head, and the sun's about to set, so we're going to go on a little beach wonder. I literally cannot go over how nice this place is. We've literally been chilling here all day and it's just it's lovely. I would highly recommend coming to Potato Head if you're in Bali. Here we have the beautiful Louisa and the sunset a la playa. And here's the Potato Head beach bar. It's looking pretty bossing. Um, as you can see, the beach stretches on for fucking ever. Um, unfortunately, we did not quite make it to Mississippi, but we can always go tomorrow. There's always potential. Um, we just have to figure out where the fuck we're staying tomorrow because we've got one more night in the little pod rooms. And then we are going, where are we going tomorrow? What area are we staying in? Changu. 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 It's Changu. only like it's, Yeah, it's literally in this area. But anyway, we're going to try and find some touristy activities to use tomorrow as well because I want to go surfing. I want to go surfing. I want to do surf lessons. Right, lads. We finished, right, lads. We finished at, um, what was it called? Potato Head. Potato Head. And now we're getting some ice cream. We've been testing out all the flavours and Kitty's getting croissant flavoured ice cream, which is quite rare. It's quite rare, but it tastes awesome. And I'm also getting a mint chocolate chip. Mint chocolate chip. Fair. I don't really rate mint chocolate. I just fucking love mint chocolate. I'm gonna get cookies and choco chips and raspberry. Which combination is better? Comment down below. Probably ours. <laughs> Hello, so it's been a couple of hours since I last filmed. Um, I'm in bed because me and Kitty are having a quiet one. We both feel a little bit ill. Um, so we're gonna give our bodies a rest this evening. But after the beach club, we went and got some ice cream, which was really nice. And then we went to a bookshop which was called Perry Plus Bookstore which was in Seminyak Square. They literally had all of the like good books. It was like a mini Waterstones actually so I really enjoyed okay. They had all the TikTok books, all of the like self-help books. I really recommend. 
I got two. I got Ugly Love by Colleen Hoover, which I've already started reading, um, which is really good actually, would recommend. I've obviously read It Ends With Us, so I was like, if I like that, then obviously I'm gonna like her other stuff. And then I also got Malibu Rising, which I've seen on TikTok, which apparently is good, because I base all of my choices off of TikTok. It's really weird, all of the books come in like plastic packaging, so it doesn't really have that like authentic bookshop smell. But yeah, Kitty's next door, living her best life, don't know what she's doing. But yeah, I'm probably just gonna keep reading from it and then go to bed. And yeah, yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Alright lads, we have currently moved Hostel from our pod to a hostel called The Black Pearl. And we haven't checked in yet because it's too early, but we've left our bags and we've gone for some lunch. And Lou's food is looking bossy. Look at those poached eggs, they're they actually better. Oh wait, let's see if they're um, soft. Ready? Yeah. Passing, oh, <laughs> oh, I'm excited. How do you feel on the scale of 1 to 10? Good. Also, we chose our hostel purely because it's called the Black Pearl yeah. Hostel and Pirates of the Caribbean. Yeah, but it has two pools, so we were kind yeah, of like... Yeah, and it's actually kind of busy because in the last hostel it's kind of hard to meet people. Oh my god, can oh, we explain about oh our last hostel? We had a rather traumatic experience last night in our pod hostel. It was genuinely the horrible. Worst, the worst night I think we've had on this trip. Agreed. So we try and go to bed at like what, like 11.30 and then we just sort of hear some snitching coming from one of the rooms next door and we were just like, oh no. It was, was the, the one next to yours. Next yeah. And we were just like, fuck. And then obviously you know what happens after that and then Lou had to come into my room because it was so awkward and me and Lou were pissing ourselves laughing. It went on for like half an hour which was horrible and then what was the next thing that happened? So the next thing that happened was <clears throat> somebody, I can't remember the TikTok sound, but somebody mm. had the TikTok sound like on repeat, maybe like, for about 15 yeah. minutes. Like, the same TikTok. On full volume. So they were obviously like editing their video or something, but fuck yeah. It was then like, me and Lou went out like, I can't I actually don't even want to think about it. No. So I'll get wound up too much. And then so that ended, and then the other people started having sex again about an hour later. No, Horrible. I told the TikTok people to shut up. Yeah. And then uh, suddenly at like 5.30 in the morning, we're rudely awoken to the sound of people coming back in, which is fair enough. Yeah, but like, like, when you come in and then yeah. kind of like go to bed, but these people were like running down like the little corridor, like screaming, and then these two boys were like not letting this one girl go to sleep, and they were like trying to stay in her room, and she was like, please, like she was like, like not screaming, but she was like shouting, being like, get the fuck out of my room, like go like, to bed. Like it wasn't, like she was like, yeah, it wasn't thing. aggressive, it was like a joke, but she was like, I want to go to bed, please. <clears throat> And they just were not leaving, yeah. and it was like it was so loud. And then Lou, I was so busy. Tell, say what you did. So I literally got up out of my pod, slammed my door, went to the toilet, came back, death stared the two people, the boys in the corridor, because we met them the night before. <clears throat> and I literally was just like, "Can you not take the hint that me slamming the door is telling you to shut the fuck up?" <laughs> and I was also I wanted to help the girl because I felt bad for her, and I was like, "Leave the poor girl alone." And then they had the audacity to be like, ooh, someone's pissy. And I'm like, bro, it wasn't 5.30 in the morning. It was 6, it was in, the six in the morning. But no, it started at 5.30 in the morning. But yeah. by the time they... And then somebody was like running down the corridor being like, anyone got a lighter and a condom? Oh, it was the same anyone guy. Anyone got a lighter and a condom? And he was going on for like 10 minutes. Right, lads, so we're in a club called X Bar. And we're with our friends. We've been reunited with the squadron. everybody um we are in a place called coco mo and it's very aesthetically pleasing today we're going to go surfing yesterday we went out with our friends which was really fun and i'm feeling a little bit tired but other than that i'm pretty good and we booked another night in Changu because we liked it a lot more than we thought we would. My last. <laughs> you look horrible. You are. We're about to go surfing. And we're having a surfing lesson because 
Maybe. I'm shit. Kitty is... I've done it before, but I'm still shit. Yeah. I mean, no, sorry, not yeah. Um, anyway, can't take you in with me, but I'll see you on the GoPro. Okay.